The reason for this, I was invited by a friend of mine, his name is David Brosa. And in Israel, David Brosa is me, Bruce Springsteen, and a bag of chips. He's a singer, a songwriter, and an activist. And uh, he uh, had this dream. Of, uh, he kind of wrote uh, the Israeli peace anthem. And he uh, had this dream for years of making a record with a half Palestinian, half Israeli man in a Palestinian studio that he knew of in East Jerusalem. And he wanted me to produce it. And you know me, I couldn't, I'm not, you know, I couldn't, I'm not afraid of, afraid of Roger Waters at all, and I couldn't pass that up, so. Uh, I don't believe in, uh, in cultural boycotts, y'all, because I was involved in one once, and the way it works, and what I've learned from it was that my job is to go and see what I see and then sing about it. That's what my job is. So, uh, I went, and uh, it, was a, it was a big deal. It was a life-changing experience in a lot of ways. Um, but, you know, so you start thinking kind of in Old Testament terms when you walk around in the temple, you kind of can't help it. So, um, it was tell Moses, and we started on the song, there's nothing we could do about it, so we surrendered, and the first verse is Exodus. That's all there is to it. The second verse um, is Shams, largely, and Martin Luther King came back. So we thought, oh, we have a song here, it's about leaders, and so all we have to do is find another leader, and we're finished. <laughs> that first day we failed to do so. And um, we thought about it, but nothing really worked for us with the other two. And we knew there was something that we were missing. And then when we got together again, we tried to find the third leader for a while. And then it occurred to us that maybe what we were, um, maybe what we, uh, the song was really about was the fact that, yeah, we have leaders. Yeah, we look up to them. Yeah, we need them. We learn from them. But... Things really change based on what we do as individuals from the time that we wake up in the morning until we go to bed each and every day. So, you have a part in this song, and when it comes along, you'll know it. You gotta sing and sing loud, because you can drive away some of the evil spirits on the other side of the border. <laughs>